by the way, how did you get onto the Contender Series? Uh, it was just kind of through fighting through the regional scene. Let's see, I had about six or seven on the regional scene, then I did LFA. And then I was uh, I was close to getting on Tough. Uh, what season was it? Uh, not the Juliana one, but I think the one before or after. Okay. Uh, uh, so I, was, I ended up being an alternate there because I was, it was I would obviously have to bump up. It was at thirty five. Uh, I didn't get that, but they're like just stay ready. Uh, like you're kind of in the in the loop already. They'll probably give you a contender last minute or something. Yeah. And that's what happened. That uh, a few weeks or a month or so later, they're like, they hit up my manager with a, a contender um, offer, and we're like, yeah, let's do it. So, just kind of had to sit out a bit. Uh, I think it was after LFA fight. I had to sit out for a bit, just kind of not risk getting hurt or whatever, and yeah, uh, show up or be ready for that uh, contender opportunity. Yeah, that just happened to like another fighter who got kicked off of uh, Tough Thirty One. He, he got like another opportunity so he'll be on contender series but i want to talk about that fight a little bit man i was looking at the guy who you beat um he's gone off on he's actually going to make his debut in the ufc in his next fight but he he's gone on to do like four first round knockouts um what was that fight like for you uh, i mean it was uh i think the only thing that kind of threw me off was like yeah. uh or not threw me off i guess just kind of something to learn from was like the aggressiveness. Cause like, I feel like I give up like easy takedowns on there, which that kind of surprised me too. Cause I, f I figured he was going to come in and want to just strike the whole fight. But uh, I don't know if he just didn't like what it was like on the feet with me or something surprised him. Uh, but uh, no, yeah, it was just it, like the whole thing. I don't know. It was wild. Cause like, like we put so much, so much went into that fight, like sitting out and getting ready and, uh like everything that came would come after it uh so it was like a lot on the line a lot put into it so uh afterwards it was just like sheesh i think like my coaches were just as exhausted as i was so uh no yeah it was a scrap for sure and um just a lot it was wild it was uh kind of just got 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 you ready for for the big leagues or the ufc it's like it's probably what it's going to be like here on out yeah and like, what? How old are you? Like twenty six? I think I was 27? 26, 27 at the time. Yeah. Okay. And this guy was what, like thirty, thirty one? Yeah, yeah. I think he was. Yeah, early thirties. Yeah. Uh, around there. So, so like, okay, I'm getting him in his prime. Right. Uh, so, and so he's we're thinking you're like a young kid. He can't lose to you. Yeah. And, like, right. The fact yeah. That you edge in the that build out. up to it, he's like, "There's no way." He's like, "There's no way any flyaway beats me. This is my chance." Yeah, yeah. And I was like, "All right, well, we're gonna see, dog. <laughs> we'll see it." <ya." laughs> When it, when it locks up and we're going.